with your options in the phone and the stick. Hello everyone, I am Exa and welcome back to my channel. So today, right before we get into this video, I do want to thank everyone who participated in this recording. Thank you so, so very much. And I also want y'all to make sure that y'all subscribe to this channel and click that notifications button if you want to see more videos like these. I'm going to be popping them out every week. Make sure you check in on Friday because that is the day that I chose for my schedule. So, yeah, and make sure you watch this video all the way because I know y'all want to get some credits, don't you? You do. Come on now. You know you want some credits. Let's go. Once again, I am Exa, the Miss Dripping Beauty IMVU pageant director and founder. I also want to let you ladies know that you do not need any type of experience with pageants or anything of this sort. We are also looking for 10 girls to compete in this pageant and make sure that you click the link down in the description box below. That is where the form to the application for the pageant will be located. We will also be looking for staff as well so if you want to be a staff member of our organization you can sign up down below as well. So now we need to go ahead and start getting into this pageant process so stay tuned. And with that being said, we're going to head over into the interview. We have chosen, handpicked, the best judges for this competition. And they are going to decide on who is the first Miss Dripping Beauty INVU queen. The interview is the first part of competition. And this is where all 10 girls will be able to participate. They will all be questioned by the judges, interviewed by the judges, however you want to say it. And they will answer the questions to their best ability. Once the judges have received their answers, they will start to tally up and see which girls are going to move on to the next phases of competition. Those five girls will be the top five finalists and they will move over into the main phases of competition. In the main phases of competition, we have casual wear, talent, formal wear, and the crowning which is not even you know it's not even a competition that's like the end of the pageant but anyway that's what's good that's the order of how this is gonna go in 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 in, 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 in <laughs> okay so basically in casual wear all girls are going to basically dress up you know put on a nice outfit you know wear some jeans or a nice skirt that you know that's casual that expresses their passion for fashion the judges are going to decide on what girl best ex executed her casual wear outfit and then once all girls have gone we're going to move on to the talent part of competition the talent competition is where girls will either do piano singing dancing acrobat stuff like that you know doing things in the performing artistic area okay the performing arts area that is that is talent all right using your performing arts you don't even you don't even really have to perform if you ain't got nothing to perform with you know what i'm saying you know just throw some up there that you know is visual okay visual that's what we want to say performing in visual arts okay i'll give y'all that i will have links down below to the applications for this pageant i will also link down below the staff applications for this pageant if you would like to be a staff member in the organization you will be interviewed by one of our staff or by me to make sure that you qualify for the position another thing i will also leave links down below to my other you know whatever i usually have down there like my instagrams and you know i'm gonna have video cards going through the video so y'all can you know watch other videos i'm gonna have you know links to some meals you know my schedule is also in my description box just in case y'all didn't know what my schedule is already i am uploading on fridays every week for the month of april so if you are looking for a video a new one at that it will be on fridays okay fridays all right so just know that
Once we have finished with our talent competition, we are going to move on to formal wear. Formal wear will play a big part in your score and is going to have three components. The main component is your dress. Okay? Dresses have to be beautiful. They have to have color. They're not going to be no sorrow, sad, black dress that ain't nobody going to want to look at because it don't. it's just like, why are you here if you're not going to bring out the passion inside of you? You know what I'm saying? So I purposely did not put no dark dresses as much as I could nothing dark because you want to see the vibrance we want to see the brightness of your dress okay ladies so make sure that you consult me for your dresses because I am also a what are, what do you call it a legacy pageant queen meaning I competed years ago and I'm still you know I'm still a queen but I'm just not the reigning queen so I know what I'm talking about ladies and y'all don't need no type of experience by the way y'all don't need no type of experience I got y'all I have you okay I got you okay so just make sure you know that and so after you have your dress prepared okay the next thing will be your interview not even your interview child your your questionnaire each girl will get a question all right each girl will get a question and they will answer that question to their best abilities the judges will also decide on which girl best answered that question all right after you answer your question you're good next thing you're gonna do is do your walk and once your walk is done we're going to get all the scores from all the judges and then we're going to move on to the crowning ceremony. And that is where you will receive your credits, your dress, your crown, your sash, and a few products from my shop. That sounds like a fair, a fair prize. And especially for how many girls? I think I'm going to do maybe like two or three winners two or three out of the top five finalists we gonna have Miss Dripping Beauty INVU first runner-up second runner-up and then if Miss Dripping Beauty is a creator she'll get an extra amount of credits okay and so it's either gonna be 60,000 or 70,000 for Miss Dripping Beauty and then first runner-up will get like 35,000 and then second runner-up will get like 18,000 credits so I think that's pretty fair you know what I'm saying so you get in the credits plus your dress plus your sash plus a crown plus some products from my shop that is more than enough ladies you don't need all that extra stuff that is enough for a pageant you won and I'm giving you your prizes okay and this is just the first pageant so if everybody likes how this pageant goes and it does well and people enjoy it and they think they want to do it again then that's when we're gonna start to you know add some more stuff in there and just you know yeah so make sure y'all sign up for this pageant as soon as you get finished watching this video thank you guys for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys next time bye guys Pulling my hand in the back of the Come right back, baby, ain't shit fake Fuck, homie, don't need to take Still can't do Never too famous to beat a bitch ass Still will do Bad little boo And she got a fatty But she don't even know how to make that shit Man, I hope too